the time form handicap chase from Haydock. I think it's three mile four furlong, so now's the time to fix a drink or get a cup of tea or something, a coffee. So zero to 150 and up the top is Hillbilly Boy for David Robinson and it is our 9 to 2 uh, pre-race favourite. Timothy Dalton, French Foreign Legion, Ashton, Last Suspect, Proud, Tarquin, Now and Then, Moon Lake, Blackbird, Toolsworth, Glen Boy, Montoya, Wild Prince, Joe Farrell, Derriere Le I think, Martin, uh, Fifth Marriage, Dell's Half, and I missed one, they're racing. <clears throat> well, looks like Joe Farrell will be our leader. So go over the first, and we've lost one there. One of Martin's now and then. So bad luck, Martin. But you've still got Derriere Le Volé, or however you pronounce it. I would have preferred if that one fell, and now and then we're still running. Up and over the second, and my horse drops the jockey. So there you go. <clears throat> the commentators are cursed. Stu doesn't have one in here, I don't think. So... Right, we got that out of the way. So we go over the third, and we've lost another. Three jumps, three casualties. Timothy Dalton's gone. Looks like James Bond met his match. The third. Past the winning post. Probably a couple of laps to go here. <clears throat> and the action's been on right from the get-go. Down to a field of 14 now. And they've already strung out too. A couple here caught wide. Blackbird. No, it'll be uh, Hillbilly Boy. Blackbird was a bit further back. So we've got uh, Joe Farrell. Goes over the fourth. Sticky jump there from last suspect. Lost a couple of lengths. So it's Joe Farrell in front from Outlaw Torn, last suspect, Montoya. So you take the fifth. And we've got Ashton, and it's just behind Montoya, the stable mates. Then we have Proud Tarquin, Tillsworth, Glenboy, fifth marriage, Dell's half, they go the next. Uh, that one's stretching right out there, I think it was Ashton. No, it was Montoya for F1 Fireless. Uh, Derriere Le Volé is behind them with French Foreign Legion, Moon Lake and Blackbird, but a long way to go. Over the seventh. <clears throat> and the pull-ups haven't taken effect yet. This one is a three-mile-plus race. So take the ditch, so we'll expect a couple more to uh, not complete the course. Just a reminder to get your uploads in this week. Any horses you, you haven't performed for you, it's a good chance to delete them and refresh them with some new stock. Over the ninth, sticky one there at the tail by Moon Lake. And I believe cutoff is around 5 p.m. Um, Actually, it might even be an hour earlier, 4 p.m. Uh, Sunday, the 21st of April, uh, England time. But uh, check the forums. Get into the online forum there and have a nose around. And there's a post there giving the exact date or exact time. So it's Joe Farrell. Still leading comfortably, hasn't been challenged at all, just went to the lead on its own accord. Nothing else wanted it. Over the 12th. They're quite strung out, second outlaw torn and last suspect. Moving up now, Dell's half and Montoya. Tillsworth, Glenboy, Proud Tarquin, Ashton as they go past the winning, pa winning post, a lap to go. Uh, then we've got Derriere Le Volé in the gold silks on the rail. The not quite sure what you colour horse that is. It's not chestnut. 
a bit lighter. Now we've got uh, Fifth Marriage, French Foreign Legion, Blackbird and Moon Lake. Ten furlongs left to run. Over the 13th they go. Oh, we dropped a jockey there on fifth marriage. Bad luck, Alex. You're in fine company, though. And with a mile to go. And over the 15th, a sticky one there from Ashton. Now, the first half of this field is starting to bunch a little. So it's still Joe Farrell in front from Outlaw Torn, Dell's half. Keep an eye on Dell's half here. It's in a good position. Six furlongs left. Over the ditch. Out the back there, Moon Lake. Need to get a wriggle on. But it's Joe Farrell. Letting go on the bend here inside five furlong and taking advantage of the tight turn. And it's Joe Farrell straightens up at least five clear and a fast jump at that one. Opens up to at least six lengths. Now running on Durl's half. Looks like the only challenger from here. Out wider Montoya, proud Tarquin over the uh, 19th they go. And uh, inside three furlongs, and it's Joe Farrow. I think this is a race in two. May even be just a race in one, but it's Joe Farrell, clear, coming towards the second last. Over they go, two furlongs left to run. Out wider, Martin's horse runs into fourth, but it's Joe Farrell. One and a half furlongs. He's about seven, eight, clear. Uh, running on strongly, Tillsworth, Glen Boy. At the last, it jumps it, and this race is well and truly over. Probably was over two furlongs ago, and Joe Farrell is going to win by a country mile. And Joe Farrell is first from Dell's half, Tillsworth Glen uh, Boy. I reckon that might be a go sapper. And it is. Congratulations, John, with Joe Farrell. Looks like they'll be heading to the National. Dell's half, second ran gallantly. Third, Tillsworth, Glenboy. Fourth, Derriere, Le Volley, and Blackbird was uh, 